14 it says do not even nature itself teach you that a man uh, have long hair it is the same unto him for men to have hair like a woman it's a shame you know this, no that's not but men look like everybody it's a universal understanding that men are, are supposed to have short hair women are supposed to have long hair it's just a, but now they're trying to kind of get rid of that nowadays when, when men got braids that come way down here and women got the short hair with the dreads and all that uh, ex exactly right yes dreads That's after dead hair, people you take. Know, it says 15, it says, but if a woman have long hair, 
it is a glory to her, for her hair is given her for a covering. That's that's meant for a woman to have long hair. So it's supposed to help cover her up, you know. But so there's no reason for me. And going to the fucking police and all, sitting in there with women. Yeah. Getting their nails, that mental section shit. That was just a way to, 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 to smear the line of man and woman. To say, okay, it's okay to get your pedicure, your manicure, get your nails clean and shit like that. It's okay to shave like a woman would shave, you know? It's a damn shame. Like 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 to get your eyebrows arched and shit like that. Man, it's, 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 feminist. it's okay if you have a woman at home. You like cut my nails, clean up your hands. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. When you up in the nail shop, shop like, yeah, like yeah. this. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
but his name isn't just Savior, and that's a, Jesus is actually Greek. It's a Greek word, right? But he was Hebrew. So his name means Savior, but in the Hebrew, to get to the, to the you know, getting to the point, because it goes a little deeper than that, and you really get the breakdown of it, but that's how it goes, though. You know, that, so his name has to be in Hebrew with the, with the meaning of his name, right? Because he was a Hebrew. Exactly. The Israelites, and they spoke Hebrew. Because that was the original, that's our original language is Hebrew. Before the, the Latinos were speaking uh, Spanish, before the, the Pisadors and Spaniards came over, they were speaking Hebrew. That's why you find the... Uh, yeah. That's why uh, you look it up on, a, uh, on Google, Go to Google Images and type in Los Lunas site. It's basically there's a carving of ancient Hebrew on a, on a big rock in uh, New Mexico. Yeah. Uh, the Ten Commandments. It's, uh, it's they try so hard they can't even get it up out of there. It's like it's in a rock. It's, it's, they a, couple of them in America. it's a couple of them off the, off the uh, that they found off the United States and even down there in Mexico. Proving that our people used to speak Hebrew before the white man came. You know, language and heritage of us. Now we speak in English and Spanish. And even there's a, there's a Moabite stone also yeah. with Hebrew on it. And, uh, in the land of Moab, which were, was worthy of uh, the Chinese, well, not in China, but I think that's in Asia. It's like Asia, so we speak like There's a Moabite stone on it. It's called Moabite stone, but it's written in Hebrew, written to describe the. Uh, that's in New Mexico. Yeah. Lost Lewis. Type in the word. Lost Lewis. Yeah. You know what type word exactly? Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. I'm from Texas. And I still know Paso. And then we ice go to New Mexico. It's called Las Cruces. It's right here. called Las Cruces. That's why I used to go to visit. My grandma used to go and buy those antiques and stores and shit. And then, like, there used to be some shit called Las Cruces. Some would go down, and hella bats would just come like, they'll fill up the whole sky with bats. Like, mm. As soon as it started getting dark, the bats would switch. Mm. A, a lot of that has spiritual meaning to it. I don't know if it's a person. At this point, and even sometimes when you go back inside to like the culture of it, yeah. of that area, people that like, basically probably own that land over that, they probably got stories written about what that was like. Like that. 
sin and just multiply it. You know? That's the way that's the way the sin goes. But we're also here to condemn the city for that same exact reason. They break all the laws. Because you go to some of these other countries and some of the shit that people do here in this city, they get whipped or, or heads chopped off and shit like that for that. You know, you go out of this state and a lot of shit don't fly like that. You know, but here it's all good here. You know, to do whatever, do what thou wilt. Like out there, you know, from the Middle East, like if they catch still only like chop your arm off for you. Yeah, they chop your hand off, yeah. Double honor to our elders. Salutations to all our 